enhance. Enhance. Damn it. Well, hello again. Let's start over. It's Saturday, December 3rd. Wow, dude. I am bald and my cap was too high. That's what I was saying. Also, there was a 12 gigabyte patch, as the text crawl says right above. Um, and of course, the general bullshit when it comes to patch notes, improvements, and bug fixes. Why don't they tell us what they did? I don't get that. I can't believe I was muted. Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, anyway. I know, Lord Nero, dude, I, I realized that. I'm like, fuck. Ugh. So, I was listening to a lot of reviewers yesterday over this, and they all say the same thing. They say this is great design-wise, but the gameplay is weird. But we're still going through it. I still have high hopes for it. Let's do it. So, yes, I'm pretty sure the, uh, where are we here? Oh, I gotta go through all this again? Uh, it looks like, uh, oh, wait a minute. I would assume that bug fixes, they say, are, uh, are gonna be for, like, frame rates. Hey man, shit happens. What are you gonna do? 35 health, etc. etc. Okay. This is actually. Oh, there's the PUBG helmet again. Okay, so I think we just routed back again? I was about to say. I was like, we came up to this area yesterday. Let's let's start off with the manual saves again. I really don't care about the audio logs, especially the fact that we can't move around while listening to them. In all honesty, with the attention to detail that the team spent on all of the graphics and the atmosphere and audio and gore, they completely overlooked the fact that we cannot move while listening to audio decks. 
Like, that is a huge detriment because Dead Space allowed you to do that, and you were immersed in the world. Because always, every time you listen to an audio log in Dead Space, it kind of gave a little bit of insight to the current environment that you're in. Galento credits! Inventory status update. You know what? Whatever. I don't care. We have plenty of ammo. That's all I give a fuck about. I can't wait to get stasis. That's gonna be fun. Or kinesis, I should say. This is, We're totally talking like it's dead space. I don't care. Because that's exactly what this is. It's just a uh, new generation of this space. That does not open. Cool. The shadows are... Oh, dude, the shadows look fucking gorgeous. Man. Jeez. This game is seriously, like, technically, on a graphical level, is really good. Oh, cool. The stasis rig, or... Yes. No, Kinesis, sorry. There is no stasis in it. No, oh, this is Xbox Series X. Where's the dude who's gonna, uh, use... Ooh, nice. Okay, this is a little better. Looks like we have four stasis modules we could use. Rip. Grab gravity resistant projector. Miniaturized graviton field generator used by UJC correctional officers to classify inmates and manipulate objects. Cool. And we can't run away either. Okay, interesting. We're reloading this. This is bullshit. Yeah, <laughs> dead space. This game is this game is full of a lot of dead spaces. Really? We gotta do all this all over again? What the fuck, man? Ugh! This is not a good way to start the day! Yikes! Yeah, this is, uh, the co I do not like the combat at all. Everything else so far is good, but the combat, yeet. So we're gonna get our stasis thing, we're just gonna run through this here. It sucks that, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, segments don't save exactly where you save them. 
I don't like that, so we gotta get the stupid audio log again. You and let's hear what you have to say for a split second because we honestly don't care. Okay, so that's ammo. Fine. We'll, we're, we don't care about it. Okay, good. And we also can't skip uh, cutscenes either. I almost said dead scenes. Found one of those gloves that Captain Ferris had. Bueller, anyone? That's cool. Just hold him. I'll get him on the Senate. Hurry. We've got prisoners headed this way. He's got bits left. You see that? Okay, so I was about to say there's the other one. Yeah, dude, this is... Wait a minute, we're not gonna... Hold on. Help, Joe. That's why I didn't use that. Okay, perfect. Callisto credits! More Callisto credits! Dude, the combat. I am trying my very best to adapt to this crap. It's weird. Thank you, thank you. You're fat, Tom. <laughs> he does everything with such anger. I would love to see how he uses his keyboard. He's like, God damn it, damn it, hell, hell, hell. Ah, enter. <laughs> when he hugs his girlfriend, he like breaks all of her ribs. Oh, yeah, what the fuck? Got that 
being so fucking impressive, man. Inventory. What the fuck? Oh my god. Dude, this is really. Oh my god, it's starting to get really gravy. We gotta see if there's something we could do with our inventory here. Fucking seriously, man. Help, Joe. Okay. Callisto credits! Callisto credits! They should uh, make that a mod. UGC printing. Have a united day. Sun baton, hand cannon ammo. No. Recharge rates. So this is three hundred bucks. Health injector. Please tell me there are inventory upgrades here. That's what I'm looking for. So we could craft ammo. Okay. Lock counterattack. Right control swing. New heavier attack. Stability. Okay, so we're gonna want let's see here. Velocity. Nine hundred. Increases recharge rate, increases launch strength by removing safeties. Max. Okay, so we're gonna do the velocity upgrade, because I wanna start tying this into combat. Have a united day. Shut the fuck up, buddy. I'll have whatever day I wanna have. Ammo, health. I'm going with the grip here. So we're going to do... Okay, so we have better recharge and more damage. So we got the first tier done. I think that's good. Because it doesn't look like we buy stuff. It looks like we do a lot more stuff. will slowly recharge over time and can also be recharged quickly with a grip battery. If the grip runs out of power while holding an enemy or object, it will drop. The grip will also automatically consume a battery from the inventory. If available, to refill the blue grip power meter on the back of Jacob's neck. Grip batteries can also be used manually in the inventory screen. Grip batteries can be... Dude, like, are people really that stupid? Jesus. Oh, that's... Dude, whoa. The... Okay. So this looks like it's done. Let's just go back in here for a second. Make sure we didn't miss anything. Use in. Oh, 
Okay, I think this house is clear. Yeah, alright. This house is clear. The details still. Very impressive stuff. Awesome. Check out the shock there. That is cool. Excellent stuff. All right, let's see here. Uh, option. Oh, really? Yeah. Combat assist. Button hold this melee assist. Continuously swing this on button hold. No, ill. Single press. No, we don't want to auto complete. health effects and the reduced camera shake okay i'm looking for there we go it's under gameplay options okay i just want to make the camera a little quicker yeah that's gonna work Okay, so we got an auto save. Manual save. <laughs> Ooh, that's cool. I like how we got the revealing of the bodies real quick. That's cool. Nice. Something's on your face, dude. Give me whatever you want. Whatever I want? How about a better combat system? Uh... Damn it! He's the fifth guy to do that. You know, I'm assuming throughout development... They were going to, like, maybe put items behind things. Because there's all these little nooks and crannies that seem quite interesting. Yet they don't lead anywhere. Or they don't, like, offer anything. So... I really want to explore everything, but outside of curiosity, there really isn't anything. Ugh. Ah! Well, I mean, you keep using the same hole to uh, inject, so it's like Bioshock, you keep injecting your wrist at the same spot over and over. Like, eventually, that's gonna start hurting, man. You have no right to complain, Joshy boy. There's a can of soda there. Looks like it's busted. We can drive it from here. Are you sure about that? It's gonna lower you down nice and easy. <laughs>
Oh, dude, that would have made for a great gameplay segment. All right, still, cool cutscene. To start turning into the guy well if vince was dead space we would have used stasis on all four break arms which we would have just saying no jacob's not here anymore oh dude the uh oh these effects these are cool that's totally a necromorph, man. Come on. Switch, motherfucker. That's kind of lame, man. I'm sorry. Health gel. Gotta keep those balls minty. Ooh, yeah! Health gel! <laughs> uh, Jacob, what are you doing? Why are you facing the corner? Doing nothing. I'm applying my health gel. Go look! Hey, man, you keep doing that. You're starting to worry me. <laughs> oh, my God! Basement story. How much do we got? Ah, oh, only 237? Fuck. I'm assuming that as we get later into the game, we're gonna start earning more. We better. It's fucking inventory. Ooh, we can skewer enemies. Nice. Ooh, auto save time. Oh, look at that! He's trying to pull me into the fan! How adorable. Was actually kind of fucking funny. Wait a minute. Come on, do your thing, bro. What? 
That does sound very cool, though. Yeah, the audio in this is excellent, man. Well, if we were right the Clark, we could stay in the pan. Yeah. Ooh. All right, we got to see here. Can we do this? Nope. Okay, so there's spikes. Okay, so we need to start paying attention to the environment. Well, we lost like 20 bucks, but hey, that's fine. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Hold on. I'm using all the wrong shit. That's alright. So we got the achievement. We'll end up killing this guy and get his fucking credits. God damn it, dude. Okay, so that thing's gonna shoot out at us. There we go. $19. All right. Terry Brown. Making sure all these are played. Loot boxes. Oh boy. Nice. Oh, so we could view. Okay, we could view what items we're going to pick up. Okay, I like that. Dude, the inventory system is weird. We're still gonna do a manual save here. Did you see that? Well, dude, there's some loading here. Okay, so let's do this. Let's back up. There's some environmental asset loading. 
Yeah, you could see it right there. So we see the hanging thing. And then as we get closer, those things pop in. And an enemy went into the floor. Does that help, Gel? Okay, that's fine. Mmm, Gel for my balls. Oh, this is the stealth segment. Okay, cool. Wow, dude. Okay. This is really good game design, is it not? Okay, we have a health job by us. Health to thank you, thank you. What the fuck? Dude, seriously? This is fucking weird, dude. This is really fucking weird. Where did this put us? Do we have to do all that again? Oh my god, man. Okay. Wait a minute. It cleared this out? That makes no sense. This is, wow, dude, it cleared out the two enemies here. Uh, whoa, okay. That, I, uh, do we need to trigger them? to reload the assets if we go back. I'm sorry, but this is really starting to irritate me now. Like, hmm. We might have to reload an autosave. Let's see. Because what I'm thinking is the enemies we're supposed to dispatch are going to hold the key items we need. And now, apparently, we could be potentially stuck. Because this is locked. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, gate views. Okay, never mind. Okay, I was just... 
I was just about to say, I'm like, uh, hold on here. That's a health gel over there, so we're gonna get that. That is so weird that the game got rid of those enemies. So we gotta keep an eye out for things in the environment. All right, that's a little better. 300 bucks, all right, fucking great. I thought that the reason I'm backtracking is I'm pretty sure I saw a gate here somewhere. Ooh. All right, so it doesn't look like it. Okay, we'll just run back. Thank God we don't have a fucking stamina meter, dude. Seriously. Please. Okay, so I'm assuming, wait a second, that this is locked by that gate, whatever the fuck, over here. Okay, cool. All right, all right, I just want to be thorough, because you never know when shit will fuck up on you. Reunite with Elias. Elias. Why is your name spelled with two S's, Elias? Well, you don't understand. It's Elias. Let's see. Something's probably going to jump out at us and try to scare us. Use haulage cart for heavy loads. Keep emergency exits clear. Check out the reflection, man. No smoking, no naked flame. Brrr. Naked flame. That sounds like a dolphin a dolphin move. Naked flame. Yoga naked flame. How's the Series X holding up here? It's giving up some warm air. All right, before... Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. Hold on a second! There is some frame stuttering going on here now, dude. Is there, like, anything here that we could... Oh, we could clamber over stuff. Nice. Okay, that's locked. We'll probably come back to that later. Hmm. That's one complaint I do have about the original Dead Space is there wasn't a lot of interactivity. However, that was made up for in its gameplay and whatnot, which was fucking incredible. It, dude, it's weird, and it's kind of jarring, and it, actually I would say it's incredible that a game from 2008 beats the absolute shit out of this. It, like, no, ap no fucking joke at all. Shoe lift. Is this where we put our shoes to lift them up? Ooh. Whoa, cool. What? The size of that thing. That's what she said. Lies. I'm in the elevator. I see the shoe. I see the shoe. Yeah. 
Rats, are you there? I see the shoe. Gondola. Use the gondola to reach the shoes. All right. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Are we going to find our shoes or Elizabeth's shoe? Because I got a lot of questions to ask her about Back to the Future 2. That rhymes. What the fuck, dude? I did. Ah! If the shoe fits. Ah! Oh my God! What are you doing to me, Callisto Protocol? gonna lose my shit on stream just that's what's gonna happen all right well if the boot yay a you trying to shut up Elias Shut up, Elias! A pistol with a grip? That makes absolutely no sense. Like a lot of things in this game. Okay. So this will help with, uh... Yeah, this... Okay, I'm assuming that's a... What the fuck? Okay, great. Uh, anyway... Yo, Ellie ass, shut up. So this now holds 10, and that should allow for a little more inventory clearance. Okay, good. 12... Uh... So how much Callisto credits do we got? I can't believe it's called Callisto credits. Could you think of anything more fucking original than Callisto credits? I feel like we're in a Chuck E. Cheese parlor, just dicking around the whole time. Oh my god, dude. Seriously, I think the biggest uh, the biggest detriment to this game is design choices. Gameplay design choices. Let's be very clear. Because we've made... The, it's quite evident that this game is beautifully crafted as far as visuals and technical stuff goes. But with gameplay design, gameplay design choices, I really question what they did. There's a lot of it that seems very artificial, and that's not good. As I said countless times when I went through the masterpiece of this Red Dead Redemption 2, even though it had its flaws, oh my god, that was incredible. And I kept saying throughout the entire 45 days I streamed that. Check it out on YouTube if you haven't already. It's great. Gotta shamelessly plug myself a little. But the only time Red Dead 2 sucked was when it reminded you that it was a video game. Callisto Protocol constantly reminds me that it's a video game, and it sucks. Wow, okay. Yeah. How about that? Nothing. A switch.
Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hold on, hold on. I might have to do all this printing fucking shit again. Save. Oh my god. All right, we just. We're gonna have to deal with it begrudgingly, of course. Wow, dude. This is, uh. So this is like, I would say you could call this the node station. You operate responsibly, you son of a bitch! Nice looking shitty gun. Wow, it looks so shitty, it's amazing. All right, we're we're looking this up. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. I need to know this, okay? How to increase your inventory space? Inventory space is limited, and you are only going to need as you need to survive in this game. Blah blah blah. I know that. Progress through the story to upgrade your suit. You must reach a certain point in the campaign to upgrade your inventory. In chapter loss, you will eventually be presented with an upgrade to your suit. The suit doubles your inventory space and increases by two health. Press the inventory button to really your ah. Okay. Okay, I see. Gotcha. So it looks like we're only going to get eight inventory spaces. They're really pulling hard for Resident Evil here. Resident Evil, Jill had eight inventory spaces, and Chris had six, and that's why I never liked playing as Chris. Ooh, are these going to start spinning? Oh my god! Inv environmental hazard! Ah! <laughs> no wonder why I feel tired. Ah! <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. I was about to say. We take the fuses out. I was gonna say if we if one was next to the other to uh to open. 
That would have been really stupid. song he's definitely like Vietnamese had song bring prize when they hospitalized to the cartel and finish blah 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 well I guess we now know what we have to do Here, give me your pins. Yeah, this is badly designed, dude. This is this is terrible design. Looks great, everything else sucks. I'm still gonna go through this though begrudgingly. I say that a lot today. But we could like bait the AI around here, and there's nothing the AI could do. This is where I start questioning things.
seriously, what the fuck? Crap. Wow. Wait, we gotta check everybody. Like, there's a lot of hitches going on. It's very stuttery. Says my ball. You make a selection, you fucker. Oh, 
answer. The choice is yours. Thanks for the reminder, man. All right, I'm going to sell a gel. Neato Completo Yummy. Happy United Day. Holy shit. That shit, man. The fuck? Okay, so there's that. We came from up top. All right. Good. Ooh, I think this is a stealth segment. We just shot him outside of the geometry. Interesting. Dude, the amount of credits we get is jokingly bad. Like, they should give us a little more, man. Like, seriously, they need to patch this. Inventory doesn't even auto refresh. <laughs> I found it. I think it's clear, bro. Elias, are you sure this is the right one? Get me out of here! What are you doing here? What the hell is going on? Did you know it was her? Is this who we're looking for? Yeah, it was. Look, I just knew it was someone who could help us. What? Why would I help you? Well, look, I've been here forever. Right? I've got all the information on this place, and I can get us to the hangar. Right? And you, you can go down a shuttle. Jesus, chill with the boys. 
But we can do this. We just gotta stick together, all right? Thanks. I'll take my chances. A word of advice, though. Don't trust him. He's not what he seems. kind of cool. That's the Necromorph face, man. Sorry. Ooh, health jump. Nice. I wonder what those give on harder difficulties. I honestly don't care, but... It's great. Ah, oh, dude. Again. The details are awesome. They pulsate. That is amazing. And that is a very... Usually when you try and do, like, round shapes with polygons, you, you see all the little segments. You can kind of see it in here. But it's getting to the point where, like, things are just looking far more realistic. And that's awesome. <laughs> that does not 
sound good? What was that? Alright, we're going to do a quick save here. Get clean. Clean the blood off, yeah baby. Uh, let's use a health item. No, what the fuck, dude? credits. We got one of those big dudes here. Mmm, <gasps> mint for my balls. Oh, nice. Freebie. First cut. Dude, whoa, that's crazy.
Okay, so we got a cool 50 points for that. Hey, Quick Dex, what's up, man? So far, my honest opinion on this is there are terrible design choices amidst some excellent technical choices. It's really weird, man. Like, if you, if someone was to say, dude, you gotta play Callisto Protocol. Uh, I'd be like, no, play Dead Space instead. Happy Saturday indeed. Everybody says this game is stressful. What stresses me out about this game is the, again, the questionable design choices. Like, it's weird, dude. It's really weird. I mean, I don't want to, like, invest in something and then drop it like a hot potato. I did that already with Destiny. Uh, I don't want to do it again, so I'm still going to go through this in full. I heard it's a short experience, thank God. Uh, but, yeah, it's such a juxtaposition. It really is, and it's a fucking shame, because there is some incredible talent behind this game. And, um, I don't know what happened, but first of all, the melee combat sucks. Like, it's bad. It really is bad. And it's not bad, like, you know, you can't stand to use it. It's the... It's the choices that drive the combat that really make you wonder what's going on here. How much do we got? 84? Fuck. What's up with you? What's going on? Doing. How you doing? How the fuck you doing, man? <laughs> Love it. Stupid thing! Cool, what you got? Anything good? Cool, he always got something good. What you playing? Oh my god, an alien flag! No! Oh, he's gone. I had a feeling you were gonna say that. I really did. How many hours total so far? I have to know. Uh, it, it has to be a lot, like 500 plus, right? Is that what you, uh, milestone left in? What, say what now? Uh, 340? Ooh, nah, dude, it never ends, man. And there's nothing wrong with that. When games do it right where they're endless, that's fine. Like, I think one of the best interpretations of that from my experience, is Odyssey. Like, you could play that forever if you really wanted to. The uh, the large, like, 300-ish battles keep resetting, so, you know, it's like red versus blue, and you constantly have, like, um, like high-ranking sentry-style enemies, like bounty hunters, after you. It's pretty cool. I heard about that. Now, I'm like, I really, out of, like, curiosity, like, there's a lot of things out of curiosity that I won't check out, but uh, you definitely are scratching the Assassin's Creed it. So when whatever version comes out, probably within the next six months, sale, I'll most likely pick it up and do and like play it in my downtime. That's what I did with Mortal Kombat 11. It's like 10 bucks, 30 altogether. This, which ugh, I don't want to get into that. Um, so Mortal Kombat kind of plays itself. That's what matters most, dude. That's what matters most. Mortal Kombat 11, I definitely got my money's worth. Elden Ring, definitely. Destiny, I did not. The, the Witch Queen, I did not. And I, I'm pissed about that. But hey, win a lot, lose a few, as I like to say. Uh, but I do want to check out Valhalla out of curiosity. And for me, it's just going to be the... Like, the hapless need to check off all those boxes. Like, I need to get everything. That's what's going to drive me to go through that. So when the Super Deluxe Ultimate Special Edition is available for sale or on sale, I will buy it. But as long as you feel you got your money worth, your money's worth, dude, that's all that matters. And I think that's awesome. This is all rusty. Mm -hmm.
Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I was genuinely kind of freaked out by that, and that's awesome. We need more moments like that here. Okay, this is more like it. May God have mercy on your soul. <laughs> Mercy's for the weak. That's right, motherfucker. Need those Callisto credits. Where you and I we agree a lot is I love those open world exploration games that keep you invested. Now again, I am quite familiar with Assassin's Creed Valhalla shortcomings. I was well aware of Odyssey shortcomings, Ghost Recon Wildlands and Breakpoint shortcomings, as well as uh, Origin shortcomings. But if it's interesting enough to keep me invested, I will give it a shot. They added roguelike mode into games a few months ago. They recently got around to it, and it's awesome. Thought I was going to suck. So, Rogue, what does that mean? Like, Assassin's Creed Rogue, or just roguelike elements? Like, Rogue meaning, like, if you die, you lose all your shit. Or is it Assassin's Creed Rogue? Or is it X-Men's Rogue? Because she was awesome. I loved her character in the uh, the cartoon. She was really hot. I fucking love that. Guy. I made it. Jack Floyd! No! Oh, we're on Europa! This must be destiny! <sighs> wow! It's like Dead Space 3! Bruv, it's bro. B R U H, not B. jobs out of that place you start off with minimal gear and skills and you get through various minimal levels and if you die oh interesting how does that translate to combat because there heard a lot of wonky things about combat like did combat improve is it still the same are there workarounds it's like it put me on a spot what do you have to say about the hell am i supposed to get there what is that supposed to mean Easy peasy, oh, lemon squeezy, Japanese. It's interesting to me because it's OP in the main game, so it's strange being a weenie guy. Ah, dude, uh, Assassin's Creed Origins had that same problem. But I like being massively OP, but you have to earn it. So, like, I went around the whole map, I explored everything, and I earned a right to be OP in that. More than sufficient. And that's good. Like, dude, here, combat sucks. It is terrible. I'm Because we're all, we were all expecting the dead space, right? And here it's like combat is really restricted to that stupid, like swing, swing, hit, hit uh, method. And it's terrible. And it's like every time you get into it, you're like, uh, and that's what I really don't like about this. Everything else is interesting, but that sucks. But in like Origins or even uh, Odyssey or even the original Dead Space, like you get invested into the combat. Okay, good, 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 good. Here, that's... Uh, I'm saving you guys grief. You could grief through me. Is there anything else you haven't told me? Callisto credits! More Callisto credits! Brett 
level mid affiliate. That's kind of cool. Let's see here. It's crazy to think that somebody actually had to texture all of these items. Space extinction and space engineer for dummies. Oh, that's a dead space reference. <laughs> Fuck my life. Oh, cool. Dude, whoa. And how many... Okay, so wait. You said... Uh, hold on. 340 hours? Damn, dude. That's investment. I put... Uh, in Grand Theft Auto Online, I put about 400 hours before I got bored. And I was like, okay, I'm done. I got everything I wanted. Like, every vehicle, every property, every unlockable everything. All the cool cars, all the new shit. Like, I unlocked everything. And that was a grind. And I'm like, I'm done. And I'm sure when the, uh, the new the new shit hits, I'll try it out, and if it's worth it, I'll do it. If not, I I, I, uh, I certainly got my money's worth out of it. It, it was fun while it lasted. It, it was excellent. Oh, uh, dude, like, uh, Mortal Kombat 11 is all about, like, grinding. I mean, hold on a sec here. I got, I certainly got my money's worth out of this, but you'll see here. Um, currently at 705, and I started on the 25th. So the 25th was... So literally eight days it took me to get this, but it's because the game plays itself. You could you could give your uh, there you go, you could give your uh, your uh, your character, quote unquote, or air quote, uh, certain augments. So when the AI battles and you can tell how the AI how to behave to an extent, it plays itself. So I just literally sit with the Xbox as on my mon on my phone. The monitor's streaming to my phone, and I'm just upstairs chilling on my, uh, like, with the TV or something, you're relaxing. And it's like, it plays itself. I have to hit the A button, like, every five minutes. It's awesome. But I've gotten my money worth out of that. And, dude, I love, I've been a Mortal Kombat fan ever since I was a kid, so. Oh, yeah, dude, no, no. Just get as much as you can. I think if you get at least 75% of your achievements, you're good. The first two Modern Warfares back in the 360 days, like or Call of Duty Modern Warfare and Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, I 100%ed both of those. I got all 1,000 achievement points. I was really happy. Because back then, it was more like uh, like challenge and single player base with like maybe a few online extension achievements. But one thing I will say that I really like about Callisto Protocol here is it's rooted in Dead Space. And Dead Space, of course, is rooted in old school sensibilities. So all of the achievements here, like if you look through the list, they're all hidden. But it's all like accumulative based, like shoot an enemy this amount of times. Shoot the enemy with this um, uh, a certain amount of times. Shoot this type of enemy with all of that a certain amount of times. Play on all the difficulties. Collect all these things. So... Once you're done, you're done. And I do appreciate that. Yeah, no, no thanks. I, I agree with you on that, dude. I swear, if we, like, were kids growing up together, like, we, we would have hung out all the time, played the same games, like, had sleepovers and all that stuff. Because we have the same outlook on stuff, and I certainly appreciate that. Oh, we, uh... Habitat... Hataba is ha uh, Habitat backwards. Where is the ladder? Where did we come from? Oh, we came from here. We can't go back up. What if I want to go... Wait a minute. This is super impressive, technically, dude. This is gorgeous. Like, look at this. This looks like high-end PC shit. This is awesome. Wow. It really does. And it's a shame that with such technical design choices, gameplay design choices are really fucking stupid. And I'd say that with, like, gusto, dude. Like, it's... So the combat is really bad. The shooting's okay, but the shooting should work by itself. But it's all rooted in that stupid wonky combat, and it's like... Ugh, it's such a juxtaposition, and I hate that. Oh, cool, we got a printing station. Nice. And I downloaded it too. Um, I'm, I think you just saw that on the text scroll. 
Uh, but it's just 12 gigs this morning. When I well, Actually, earlier this afternoon, it was around noon when I was going to start, and it's like 12 gigs. I'm like, oh. Uh, it's just the same bullshit. It says uh, bug fixes and general gameplay improvements. Like, they didn't list anything. And there's still, like, frame rate stutters. Like, this runs smoothly, but there are a couple of instances where there are frame rate stutters, and it's kind of weird. Unit online. Oh, 500. Nice. I know, it's it's all PR, dude. It's fucking stupid. Hmm. Please use responsibly. I'm gonna just upload, up, yeah, upload, upgrade all of this. I wonder if Lurk's 3D printer looks like this. I didn't do anything. Hold down the left stick. Hold down the left stick to block an enemy's melee attack. If you successfully block, attack will result in much less damage. After blocking, look for an opportunity for an attack. Low attacks will damage and knock it down. Press the right bumper to perform a heavy melee attack. Heavy melee attacks have a longer wind up but cause more damage. Can hit multiple enemies and knock them back much farther. Ooh. Oh, 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 okay. Just do me up, god damn it, walk straight forward. Alright. So we great. We're gonna hit all that shit. Why don't we have save game? What the fuck? Is it loading? Slide down or anything like that. Oh, uh, we can't save. I don't like that. This reminds me of Alien 3. This is kind of cool. Uh-oh. Right down to it. I just need to follow it back. 
Oh, I see. Oh, interesting. No, I didn't. God damn it. Are you fucking ki Okay, I was about to say. If we're not able to climb back up this ladder, I'm gonna be pissed. Keep on doing that. Please okay. make a selection. Let's see, 190, so that's 490, that's gonna be 580. Oh, we can only set really? Wait, we have a grip down there, right? Fuck it. I'm gonna go for it, I don't care. UGC printing for all your needs. There we go, perfect. In progress. Cycle complete. Empty. It's weird that it doesn't count the ammo that's uh, loaded into your gun. It's cocked. It doesn't count the cocked ammo. Dude, are you kidding me? Hold on a second. If this did what I think it did, this is gonna piss me off. Okay, I was about to say, if this was gonna, like, get rid of all of that shit, I was gonna be really pissed. Okay, 
Okay, so we obviously can't go there. We have to go here. Because it's illuminated. It's clearly a thing that we need to uh, do. Follow the blood. I was kidding, man. What was that? Oh, shit. Okay. Dude, the, oh, I can hear farting. <laughs> Love it. Getting there. Covered in poo poo. Yucksies. Ew, yuck. He's certainly seen better days. His head's pretty big, too. That's a lot of autosaves. I don't like the, the... A lot of shit in this is quite archaic. I don't like that. Entry 21C. Guards on rotation. I've got to make this quick. Yes, I need to take six years. I've got five inside. Probably Emil in here. I see. So what? Wait a minute. So when you uh, when you collect stuff that you and you don't have space for the rest, those extra items will remain in a box. I don't know who I just picked up because I wasn't paying attention, so I'm just going to like go through them. I had the phone. I didn't have a choice. It's now broken. Personal log. Yeah, 
Yeah, dude, this is totally dead space. Not in all, any of the good ways, though. Which is highly unfortunate. I know that! He said, no, we need to go somewhere else! Follow the blood. Damn, dude. <laughs> the fucking texturing in some of these things is crazy good. I think we're gonna get a jump scare any second now. Okay, so he's gonna try to. Yeah, he's being a necromorph here. He's doing his best necromorph impersonation. <laughs> there. So let's see, he can jump out of the fence. Wait a minute. Voranus. I had uh, stomach complications my entire life. Voranus. <laughs> Why is that so funny? Boranus. Okay, so this is where we came from. We saw him crawling over there. Alright, cool. So we gotta go this way. Boranus. Brian Laven. Even. Ah, we're like that. Whoops. I need to keep following that red light.
much for following the red pipe. Follow the white rabbit. One pill makes you larger, and one pill makes you small, just as Gallus. When she's ten feet tall. Hold on. I hear something. Cool, we are right back here. Nice. All right. You know what? I would rather have the extra health, stupid rip shit. Ooh, what's this? Nice. Thank God saving doesn't take forever. Holy fuck. Five minutes per save. What? Uh, we have. Okay, that's weird. We could have just hopped down that, man. Fuck. Dude, there's a face there. Holy fuck. Yeah, this is cool. Graphically, this is incredible.
This is going to put us in the room to the right, or that door that was closed. Yeah. Yep, there we go. Cool. Ooh, a printer. Nice. So 900, 2700. So it's 3 times 3 is 9, times 3 is 27. Yeah, same thing. Okay. Okay, so this is the save point. The fuck? like it has elements of a mobile game. selection. The fuck? Maybe we have to go here then? Aha! Okay, I was right. I thought that glitched out. I was gonna say, like, what the fuck? item. I do not like how 90% of our items are locked behind these loot boxes. It's very gimmicky, and it does not feel organic whatsoever. I don't like that. you fucking cheapo. Four bucks.
need some fuses. They're huge. <laughs> Those fuses are huge. Oh, cool. Let's see. Is there going to be an enemy? Blah, blah, blah. is getting really fucking choppy. Holy fuck, that's not good. Cannot wait. Cannot wait to get more fucking inventory space. Mmm, green unknown goo injected into my body. Yeah. I don't even want the health. I'm just addicted. Go up here for this, like that. There's... Okay, I see what's going on. Yeah, bullshit. That's what. Yay, bullshit. Woo, boy. All right, guys, we're gonna get to the next uh, main checkpoint here, and we're gonna call it a day. Not bad. Okay. This is kind of doable. Assume that's where it wants us to be. Nothing else down here. Okay, cool. So this is a lockbox. Lockboxes are usually like side doors and shit. going 
back. Okay, so we got handgun ammo. Let's go see what's in that other door. Because this tells me that um, when there's usually like more ammo, that leads up to a boss battle or some enemy encounters. So we're going to go here. Storage hall. Okay. So I guess the exchange gate fuses? Looks like it. I came all this way for $14. All right, nice. help there too okay good to know we don't need it though because you know limited inventory space fuck dude all right let's go into that room we'll see what happens there the next auto save i am done for the day until monday wow what's up what happened Okay, perfect. UJC Printing. Have a united day. Ooh, we're going to hold on to Yeah, 
we're holding on. So this is only going to cost us 1800 So we need 700 more bucks. Let's see here. Help. It's only 10 That's not worth it. Hmm, this guy's going to be like, Yo, what's the thing? Just a pair of arms. Oh, it's a spider. Ah. Oh. I knew that was coming. Come on, man. Don't tell me you didn't know that was coming. Stop looking at me. Don't look at me funny, man. You fuck! Shoot the tentacles. That's what we needed. Interesting. Okay. Okay, so let's see here. Lounge. This is where the printer is. Okay. Dude, I love seeing this. Let's see. This should be a stupid sell item. Uh, uh, plenty. Yeah, that's how I feel about this game. Yeah! This game is having its moments, and those moments are awesome when you're not reliant on the stupid melee system. The melee system is garbage, dude. Like, I don't like... Again, I don't like saying that about something that people work obviously very hard on but it's not very well designed it is not at all very well designed so that's gonna let's let's sell this let's get back to that room please make a selection We're going back in here. There's a health item I saw. And it's going to be on the wall. Where the fuck was it? Oh, this is... Wait a minute. We're going in circles. Hold on. We got to go back the other way. So, here. Yes. Dude, when this plays like Dead Space, it's good. I'm like, I'm constantly going back and forth between how much I hate and how much I love this. It's such a shame. Such a juxtaposition. God damn it. All right, so hold on. We're, we're playing this a little longer. I want to get that upgrade and save it so we don't have to worry about it when we start on Monday.
So it's this way. Oops. We're doing that. Whenever I spend ammo like that, it's because of inventory. Kind of lame, but we gotta do what you gotta do, you know? Okay, good. Okay, so we've already checked that. That's one, two, three hundred bucks. So we could get, we could sell these two, and I believe get that upgrade. And if not, we'll just do as we'll. Uh, if not, we'll just take stock, and then we'll wrap. I'm assuming that ladder's gonna open up, and we're gonna go up it. Okay, so... Oh, shit. 16. Okay. Hmm. I don't want to leave myself itemless. Okay, so almost there. Fuck it. Let's keep going. I don't care. Let's go. Let's go. It's Saturday. I got nothing else to do. Okay, yep. Come on, bring it on. I'm not meleeing you. I'm gonna fucking shoot you.
Let's get to an autosave, guys, and we'll call it a day. We'll continue with this on Monday. I'm not playing this at all off stream. I'm going to reserve this for stream only. I want to experience this with you guys. Together! Oh, shit. Uh, come on! Come on! Ah! Let's make That's a big hand. Damn thing won't quit. Stinks. Hope there's nothing in your eye, dude. Come on, autosave. No, autosave. All right, auto save. Let's go. Well, I guess I'm going this way. All right, guys. Unfortunately, that's going to be it for today. I would continue to go, but I uh, it's Saturday. I'm calling it. This, you, when this is not trying to do its own thing, I am engaged. And then the second we get into that stupid melee bullshit, it's really bad. So this is... Uh, this is the most love-hate experience I've ever had so far. And it's a damn shame because it's good. It's only when it wants to be. Otherwise, it's not so much. That's it, guys. I'm out of here. I'll see y'all on Monday. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Please be safe. I'll see you soon. Thank you always. And check this out. This will be on YouTube as well for those of you who missed it. I'm going to upload it after we're done here. Peace out, guys.